Hello friends, welcome to C Programming Tutorials. In this class, we are going to learn about binary input output. From last few classes, we learn about text input output. In today's class, we are going to discuss about binary input output. In that, the first concept is text versus binary strings. So based on our previous classes, there are two types of files. One is text files, another one is binary files. In this class, we are going to learn about what is the difference between text file and binary file. So what is a text file? A text file stores data, stores data in the form of alphabets, digits and other special symbols by storing their ASCII values. So what is text file? So text file stores data, stores data in the form of alphabets, digits and other special symbols by storing their ASCII values. By storing their ASCII values. So coming to binary file, a binary file is a collection of data stored in the internal format of the computer. A binary file is a sequence or a collection of bytes which are not in a human readable format. So what it means, for example, if I create a text file, if I create a text file, in this I write high, I write high. Now, the data is human readable. If I create a binary file, if I store high in this binary file, then that is in zeros and ones and it is not in human readable. Okay, this is the basic difference between text file and binary file. Okay. So now we see one example. So this is the 768A. So how we can represent this data as a text file and this data as a binary file. So what is the definition of text file? Text file stores data in the form of alphabets, digits and other special symbols by storing their ASCII value. So what is the ASCII value here? For example, this is the A. So what is the ASCII value for A? That is 65. 65. Now, so this is the 8 bit representation of 65. Okay, similarly, 8. For 8, this is the ASCII value. 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0 is the ASCII value. So, similarly, for 6, so this is the ASCII value. For 7, this is the ASCII value. Okay, now the 768A is stored like this if your file is text file. But coming to if the file is binary file, so what is the definition for binary file? A binary file is a collection of data stored in the internal format of the computer. What is the internal format? For example, I want to represent 768. 768 in binary number. Then, so this is the representation. So this is the representation equals to 768. And similarly, so this is the representation of A. Okay. So now, if you select a binary file to store 768A, then the data stores like this okay if you select text file then the data is stores like this so what is the difference between text file and binary file text file stores the data in the form of alphabets digits and other special symbols by storing their ascii values so coming to binary files binary file stores the data in the internal format of the computer okay and how to open a binary file. The basic open operation is same as the text file, only the mode changes. So how we can open a file? By using F open. F open. If you want to open the binary file, then also the function is the same, but the mode will be changed. So normally we know so W or A. If you want to create a binary file, then you are going to append WB, RB, AB. Remaining all same. So fp equals to f open. Here you can give the file name and you specify the mode as wb, rb, or ab. Okay. So similarly, so closing binary file. It is also similar. The closing operation is same as text file. So f close and you specify fp. So what is the difference between text file and binary file? So text file are human readable. In text file, each line ends with slash n. And 
there is a special character known as EOF to identify end of the file. Similarly, binary file. So binary file not in human readable. Second, there is no lines or new line characters. And third one here. So how we can identify end of the file in binary file means by using EOF marker. Okay. I hope you all understand what is the difference between text file and binary file.